off to get the cans, it just stopped sprinkling. That's good. Well, I'm on the job. I don't know where I am at. be best for me to uh, set this fence off here okay. and I'll have to have two hands to do that with. <laughs> a little trouble to carry this camera along Hard to tell if this is off or not. So I went over there and put it on the 1x42 belt sander. Usually you can tell pretty good when it's off, but uh, it's hard to tell for some reason on here. Now in there is a different story. Hard to see in there, especially in the bead blaster. I think I'll clean up these sides here too on the grinder and uh, that helped because one side rests down on the other, rests down on that. You just can tell by the color. It come off around there on the bottom. Not so sure about in there, but according to that little uh, place right down, right in here, it come off. And right down in here. Yep. All right, I gotta put these back on. I'm gonna put this first one back on. Yep, them go up. A pair of ladies was so scared down here that uh, they lifted the whole fence up. They didn't have, they didn't know to push it. Just that later. Just leave that laying up there. The nail about. The skull goes on there. Down here, let's get this one off. That one was really in there. Thought I was gonna have to take over for a minute there. Went. Alright, this fix should go to the bead blaster and we gotta get that off the fence. Uh, lay them bolts up here because uh, you never know who's walking around in the woods. That one's down, way down here. I think it takes a different size socket. Oh. Long walk here. Second one. Please, I got it. 
Alright, that just took me a little break. Now it's time to go put these back on. Back in the woods. You know, I could film this whole thing and then speed it up, but it takes forever for that to load when you're doing a speed up. So I ain't gonna do that. Could have run a little hammer, but I did not. And I doubt very seriously if you can tell where that was. It was extremely low. So what we'll have to do is set that on there and judge where the top one goes. I think it's way I think low. It needs to be right here. Yeah, uh, we'll figure it out in a minute. A little rust get on there, that's what I'm wanting. And I ain't gonna show the sign up above there. All right, everything else in here is uh, top secret. I can't even pick up the camera and move it around. Now I gotta get this back out here. And I gotta back the lawnmower trailer right here it's just the right height to work on that thing and uh, my board that's actually the trailer board that we're using for everything around here yeah buddy little fan fix up over here and still sweating badly and that fan blows more than you think it will. It's blowing my shirt tail up into the grinder like this. That's dangerous. If I had a cameraman, I'd show you how I'm holding this grinder here, Harry. On the edge right there. In case you want to... Uh, do that sometime. When you use this uh, wire wheel buffer here, you kind of, it's kind of like uh, it smears the metal grains. And uh, it's not good for painting, but it will keep things from rusting for a while. And this had rusted back through the, the two or three days it sat in there. So, it's a possibility that somebody spilled acid right here. Battery acid or something, I'm not sure. Well, I'm gonna fix me up some stuff here to uh, neutralize that just in case it is. Best thing to do. All right. All right, Harry, I'm gonna show you how I'm doing this buffer here. I'm holding it on my leg. Yeah. It ain't as hefty as a nine inch Sioux. That's pretty hefty. But anyway, that'll save you on your back a lot. Oh, yeah.
One more side to go. Yeah, buddy. Would you get out of there, you camera hog? Oh, there you are. Oh, boy. Next project. I got a flat on the rear. And I believe I got a flat here somewhere on the front. And that means got to deal with that weight right there. That thing ain't light. Got to pull that tire off and get that tube out. Hey, buddy. Must be this tire. Yeah, this tire is flat. I may have a tube in there. I need to use this homemade scrape blade real bad. Or I might call up old Cliff Buddy. He got a brand new scrape blade over, I believe. Only thing is it won't fit this tractor. He got the fast hitch. Last side. Now I need to see what I can do. Uh, put something on there to neutralize that just in case that is acid. Like from a battery or something. Who knows? And according to that link that Mr. Brook put on there about these fellas, you won't see him till another 17 years. Did I see him 17 years ago? <laughs> I don't know. Let me go down here in the top secret deal. Looking good. Harry, you can't see it. This fence right here is to keep uh, Harry from running right under and jumping off in the branch. Know what big wussy he is. Mushroom, Todd. Think this little blower is a wimp? It's blowing in weeds way over yonder. Yo, is. Keep people from going the wrong way and they will go the wrong way. 
we had to put up arrows and signs, you know, and still they're going the wrong way. So this year, I'm going to do something different. I'm going to put up the ugliest picture that I can find, and that way they'll be sure and not go that way. For some reason if I got it off or not but I made sure I went over there and put this on the uh, 1 by 2 to 42 if I could just talk a 1 by 42 uh, 